The drone is just killing these things left and right. All these, oh, look at all that bug juice. Wink, wink. No, I mean, Dylan here, you should all know, is quite the burrito maker. Dude, yeah, I can, dude. I can nuke the freaking best burrito you've uh, ever had. You haven't had a burrito until you've had a Stockham bean and cheese burrito. Mm, yeah, there's something special about the, about one of those. Hmm. I'm sure you could step up your game a little if you wanted to with some cilantro and tomato. No, 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 no. Don't ruin my burrito. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, I mean... Trailbenders Overland is presented by Stockham Media and supporting sponsor, The Waterport. Our morning begins with packing up and heading to Vegas to rendezvous with Stephen. Good morning. Rise and shine. We're still alive. We didn't get eaten by anything wild, so that's always a good thing. And the sun is shining bright. It's a good day. Yeah, we are alive. Yes. We got a solid four hours of sleep. I kind of wanted to sleep another like half hour, but the sun woke us up, so. It's one overgrown road. There's even a sign warning us about how it was not maintained. New to Michael. Yes, it, hey, I've had my share of adventuring, but that was a new one on me, yes. How stoked are you about meeting up with yeah. Steven in Vegas? Dang! Dang! <laughs> Vincent's barracks. I haven't seen Steven since we filmed season two. In there, bud. Oh, you know, gotta tie those shoelaces, make sure everything's secure for the debauchery we're about to go through today. It's gonna be a lot of being on the road, for one thing, and then, yeah, we'll see what the side streets bring us. Rock and roll. <laughs>
like this. You're like, like, no. <laughs> you alright? Uh, you should check your Instagram. Yeah. Season three. Season What's up? Season three. What's up, buddy? <laughs> Steven, Michael, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Michael. Hey, I've heard Dad. good things. Uh, season hey, three? Hey, I got you something. Nah, I got you something. I'm editing, uh, some editing skills. Oh, shoot. <laughs> What's up, Chili? What? Dude, no way. Where'd you... Dang! Dang! And water <laughs> Dude, Shoot! Dude, Hey, try it on. Alright. How's it fit? Dude, crispy. Perfect. Hey, what check this out. What do you think, Chili check Bear? Check this out. Dude, it's like season two. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> what? You got a I got V neck. You got V neck. Matching. Back. Mm. No, look at the side. Water port. Water port. Wait, 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 no, look at the side. Yeah. Hey, flex. <laughs> hey, what do you think about the new shirt? You look cool? Chili! Give me a hug. Come here, bud. <laughs> Don't worry about him. Super soft. He's I got one for eight. Alright, we got our new water ports here. Super excited. We got two of them one for Hawk, one for Steven's truck. Check this thing out. These are a work of art. My favorite part about this is gonna be new pump cap. How cool is that? Okay, so what we need to do now is figure out how we're gonna get this thing mounted on the custom mount that I made here for the old water pipe. This one's gonna get relocated and new one's going here. So we're gonna yard this thing off and see what we can get done here. Probably should have emptied it first. Okay, there we go. All right, let's get these boxes open so we can see what kind of mount we have here. There it is, the new hose. Awesome. That's a hose. There it is, okay. These new water ports come with a ton of different mounts. There we go, I got the bar mount there. And the, uh, the you know, hands-free shower mount. There's the hitch mount. Super cool. There's the universal mount right there. So we gotta figure out how we're gonna get this on to here. It comes pretty much ready to mount on anything, which is rad. So I pulled this Unistrap bar off of here, which is what the other water, the other water port was mounted to with the straps. And we're, I uh, had some extra long bolts that we could get through there. Um, and I'm moving it over to the front and lowering it down, and I'll go right there. And that should get the water port to clear the tent when the tent opens. So we'll get that mounted and then show it to you all done. All right, it's all mounted. We're good to go. We're gonna fill this thing up and then go get started on the next one. All right, so on this truck, we're going with a hitch mount. So let's go set this up. Oh. Mm. Like, right. an old, like 
like an old glove. <laughs> For this venture, we're not going to be taking Robin. Uh, Robin has a few issues, as you know from last season. Um, the transfer case, there was something going on with that, and I haven't really uh, worked on it too much since then. Uh, but we do know that the four-wheel drive doesn't work, and then also um, the 3.0, the head gasket blew. So I got to get a lot of work done on this before we can take it out and enjoy um, some more adventures with that. Uh, so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be taking my dad's 2004 Dodge Ram 1500. It's all set up. It's ready to go. Uh, we just filled up the water ports. Uh, we just got everything packed into the truck. And uh, so, yeah. Pick up right here. Copy that. We're gonna go pick up some food. And some water. The and essentials. Then, yeah. You know. And then head out to Zion. They're still with me. So, fun fact, I actually uh, broke my GoPro uh, housing. The uh, the latch busted off or something. I don't I don't know, but um, so that's no good. So what I'm using is a <clears throat> an iPhone holder to hold my GoPro so I guess you gotta adapt and overcome to any situation that you uh, that you have to so hopefully that will work it looks good are you guys gonna help me study for my ham radio test? yes okay so I'm gonna go ahead there's Allie right there she just passed me Yeah, she did. She waved. Not at me. Dang. Well. All right, so we're about to hit the 215. And from the 50, uh, 215, we're going to hit the 15. And it's going to be a 212-mile drive to um, Duck Creek, and that's where we're going to stay tonight. Did it, Now, did you decide whether or not... Ooh. Look at all this traffic. Oh. So we kind of called an audible. Um, initially, we're supposed to head out to uh, Duck Creek, and the GPS is saying that it's about five hours away. Since we're on limited time, at least I am on limited time, um, we're going to head in that direction, but we're not going to um, head to Duck, Duck Creek and spend the night there. Okay, so we've had a change of plans. We're gonna take a detour out towards Valley of Fire, which is only about 10 minutes away from. Um, I haven't been there since 2015, so I'm super excited. Uh, after that, we're gonna see if we can find some BLM land camping and uh, try to make it to the lake for a quick dip. Sounds good. 
An important thing to remember is to be flexible with your plans. We have found some of our favorite spots from last minute location and timing changes. Made it to Valley of Fire. This place is rad. Just stopping to take some quick photos. Valley of Fire does not disappoint. And if you're ever in the area, it is a must see. Oh, three quarter mile. Yo, this is top shot. Oh, right one here. and three quarter. Yeah, this is drive the rigs right up in here. <laughs> you guys can camp right there. I'll camp right here. Super red sand. We're just working at Sony in the mail room. But you were at Sony. I was working at Sony Pictures um, in the mailroom. I got to meet so many people, but I got tired of the corporate structure. I have created fire. <laughs> the valley of fire. The valley of fire. The crisp blow. <laughs> <laughs> we scurred me like that. I almost fell. <laughs> Dang. It's a ways. And when you're, that's a, that's the thing I hate is like, cameras can't tell depth. No. You can't that's tell. A, that dude, that's a, you ain't coming out alive if you were to fall off of that. What did you guys think of Valley of Fire? Bomb. Freaking it's awesome. This was a good uh, pit stop. Well, we didn't, we, we thought we were we going one place. That, we didn't plan for it. We're just like, hey look, there's a sign for Valley of Fire. Let's go there. Yeah. It's getting dark now though, if you can't tell. I and mean, we got huh? I wasn't even supposed to come. Like, no. You were eating bread. Steven wasn't going to be here, and then suddenly he is, so that's awesome. Um, I had to make an appearance for season three. Yeah. Journey to the expo. Yeah. Um, but it's getting dark. we got to head over. We're going to see if we can find a spot to camp near Lake Mead. Um, maybe, maybe take a quick night dip in the water. Skinny dipping? Skinny dipping! Dang. Who's down? Have a little minnow pop up and uh, <laughs> swallow your hole there, Dylan. Well, <laughs> hi. Uh, as far as I've never been back here or been in the area that we're about to go, so I have no idea um, what to expect when we get over there. But I know that there's just a lot of uh, open land, and so, yeah, so we won't have a problem trying to find a spot down by the water for sure. So we. miles from a spot where we think we might be able to camp on the water. We're going to go check it out. Wonderful.
long day of prep and travel, we made it to camp, tonight on Lake Mead. Never underestimate the power of satellite view in a MAPS app. You're good. There you go. Good. Anybody happen to bring bug spray? Right. Well, once once me. once we uh, once we get the tents all out, then it'll be good. See people. You know what's funny? Fires here. You know what's funny? Why is it Vendel over there? Uh, that you almost freaking busted your ass. Michael. Yeah. When you what? turn the lights off, you can't see the bugs. It's they're, not a problem anymore. Now so they're going to my truck. <laughs> Turn them all on quick. Awesome. Big Bertha. Hey, you remember a freaking, uh, what's that bird um, off of uh, that Walt Disney movie back in? Bird? The Rescuers. You remember that movie? Oh, yeah. That's never, a... never ending. Or... Oh, water's right here. Oh, a finger ring. Is it nice? Freaking Loch Ness Monster. Yeah, dude. Mega nice. Anybody bring a fishing pole? Dude, it drops off right there. Dang, you just jacked my light. Oh, thanks. It's actually like a comfortable temperature. Oh, crispy. I'd be down like in daylight. <laughs> right? But definitely don't. Oh, there's the Loch Ness Monster out there. I hear him. He's freaking out there, dude. Old Bermuda. We got the Loch Ness Monster right there. I can see him. I can almost touch him. It's like I'm one with the Loch Ness. Insert Wilhelm scream. <laughs> I just... <laughs> What's about that Loch Ness Monster? <laughs> I just choked on a freaking bug. <laughs> I'm... Bang. All right, I guess he ain't, he's already full from dinner. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, let's get the the, uh, the rigs going, and then uh, we can start prepping for food. Oh, dude, look at this! Ah, what the heck? I'm not the only one full from dinner. Ew. Dude, dude, that's a full-on freaking skull right there. I, um, is it? Damn. You know what I'm making? What? Chili quiles. Ooh. My wife made it one time and it instantly became my favorite meal. So hopefully I can do this somewhat or half. I'll be happy if I get a quarter good. Cause she makes it like perfect. And we're kind of limited on supplies. This isn't the best knife to use, but it's working, so I'm not complaining. What you making over there? Dirty martini. Hmm. Right. Oh, thanks. <sighs> good. So good. Actually, I can't. Do it. Where's the cheese at? The monster out there. Cut onions. <laughs> Dang. You've been cutting cheese. Well, I've been cutting the cheese. Time to grow. Best part of the trip. <laughs> Proof that we're not like a total waste in the kitchen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Apparently I am. <laughs> Time for a taste test on this uh, chile. Chile quile. Chile quile. Freaking delicious. You may need to add more salt. I was light on the salt. Bang ring. Is it? Dang. Dang ring. Oh, that's so good. Oh, that's like all the best flavors in the world. Dude, <laughs> right? When in doubt, add cheese. Yes. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry you guys aren't eating this right now. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah, Alright, I'm gonna make a martini. Breakdown's alright. It's alright. <laughs> it's alright. Bangerang! Mom! Oh, 
Oh, it's like, yeah, dude, but, cool. it, but it's. Oh. Now you're good. No, we've been. Yeah. You, no, we're doing it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fish just nibbled on your foot. Yeah. yeah. Did and you Goliath feel it too? Just jumped out of the water right oh, oh, there. Oh, hey, look, there's ground right there. What is that? As long as there's not like sharp trees sticking. I know. I'm that's so... what I'm worried about. Dude, I'm. I... All right. <laughs> How about this? <laughs> How about we negotiate on this? <laughs> How about we think twice? Let's how about how about we get up early in the morning? <laughs> nah! And we, nice. Nice! That's why we're all holding our bodies right now, like. <laughs> and every time I touch new skin, it just freaking <laughs> <laughs> you guys keep going farther and farther away from me. They come in. I'm trying, but I don't want to, like... All right, bud, so let's do this. No. Yeah. Dude, if, if, no. Yeah. Hell no. Hell no. <laughs> count of five. We're going in all together. All right, count of 25. 20. <laughs> three. No, I'm not for three. I'm not prepared for Four. That. Three. three. Oh, it's shallow! It's gushy! It's gushy! Like oh god, oh, it's kind of oh. <laughs> Dang! So gushy! Oh. <laughs> Let's see who can get to the other side first. Oh. <laughs> Ready, go. Oh, Don't go leave go. me over here. Alright, so slippery. Ew, it's mushy. Uh. <laughs> wow, that was a rock. Let me take a shower. Oh, we did it. <laughs> we did. We, we did. did it. Ow. 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 Here, I see all over doing that. Ow. You guys. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh. Next on Trailbenders Overland, Journey to the Expo. We head to Zion National Park where we tackle the Narrows. Stay tuned. Good? So good. Why are you at 2.0? You want to be at 1.7? I didn't do it on purpose. Jib. I was at 60. Filming 50, 60 with 50 shutter speed, and you were filming at 2.0 when it's a 1.7 lens. I'm sorry. At least mine doesn't like actually ruin anything. It just is an eighth. Dang! Third. The old Jip. Burger. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you this. want any of this? 